it's receiving every day like 3,600 ton of wastes. The city is really struggling, you know, to deal with this amount of waste. Once it was supposed to be at the outskirts of Zadzawa, now it becomes inner city. So it is already surrounded by settlements. So it is, you know, imposing uh, environmental and socio-economic problems for the whole surrounding area. Once we have a severe waste accumulation under the typical open dumping, where the people just put the waste, you know, on top continuously. The way of management tend to be just creating very steep cliffs. Then due to you know, heavy rain happens all over the world. And by this rain and also the anaerobic condition inside the waste body, the, the stability of that high steep waste accumulation tend to be collapsed very severely. Koshe is an open uh, dam site which is not really designed in appropriate manner of the landfill management principles. Being with UN Habitat, uh, we have been working to implement the new technology, the Fokoka method. That technology is solving the problem of the landslide. Koko method is a very and a simple technique and low cost. This is a sustainable technique for the landfill method. It's a semi-aerobic landfill concept, aerobic condition. It is very useful to accelerate the decompose and to reduce the methane gas. ሰሚን <laughs> And the Ghana, yeah, lemon, I